Hello? What's up? What's up? Hi, Wynette. Okay. Get somewhere quiet. So I'm, I'm assuming you must have already heard your baby papa from me. Nah, what's your name? What you doing in the room? Who is it? You're, well, first of all, this is a single show. I just answered the phone. I didn't know it was your baby mama until she came on looking for love. But she looking for love? <laughs> My baby daddy is quote unquote famous. My baby daddy is wide neck. It's who? Wide neck. Who's wide neck? The dude that went viral from his neck. No. Yeah, you'll have to check him out. He on Instagram, but yeah, that's my baby. He's dad. famous. Hold on. Gosh. He's famous. Yeah. This your baby daddy? Yeah, that's him. Uh, Alright, so he do got a million followers, and his neck is really wide. Yes. So which baby daddy <laughs> is he? Is he the one that have you have four kids by or one kid? Four. So your four. So did it? Did y'all break up after he got famous? Yes, ma'am. What? Why'd y'all break up? Because he, he's a, excuse my language, he a man that ain't never really had shit. So when he got in the light and his women started coming at him, like, it was a problem for me. You feel me? Like, it's either we together or we not. And I have been, like I said, we have been together way before he turned famous, 16 years. It got too much on me, Kendra. Like, it was, it was too much. Did he always have a wide neck? Yes, he was born like that. His mother carried him for 10 months and the fluid bagged up in his damn neck. He went to the doctor. He didn't want to get it fixed. So that's the outcome. This Let is one of our kids right here. This is my six year old. That's that's six. Hi, baby girl. Hi, baby girl. So this is your this your baby daddy, yes. the one with him. My child's father, I just put the bitch in jail the day after Thanksgiving for a child support purge because the motherfucker don't take care of my kids, Kendra. Let me ask you this. Some people think that you are a little bitter about this situation with your child's father. Do you want to respond to that? Um, I mean, I'm a mother of five kids. I get no help. So if I am seem a little bitter to you guys, then that's the reason why, bro. Like, I shouldn't have to be made to take care of these kids by myself. With him being who he is, he's financially stable to help me. So what they talking about, Kendra? They ain't walking in my shoes. I don't give a fuck about it. Nah. Better that. But anyway, back to the show, Kendra. <laughs> he also told me she gonna put you in jail for child support. And I said you better pay your child support because you don't want to watch that. I promise you now, but you know, you know, when you catch the fame, you get the money, you get the power, you feel that's you know, I you know when you catch the fame, I can't you see your face. You know, you get you feel the shit change. So it's like a lot of folks fall on you. A lot of folks switch up. A lot of folks, you feel me? It, it's not. It's not. But are you a lot of folks? Because what she's saying is, you're the one that switched up. You're the one that got famous, and you stopped taking care of her and the four. No, I take care. I take care of my kids the rest right of this day. See what it is. See, see, it's two sides to every story. And one thing about it, I've been through like I've been in our prison all my life, so. Like for me to change for the good and to better myself and, and still to you moving on with me, you don't want to leave the city. I gotta leave the city. I've been there all my life. I've been a criminal, I sold drugs, I sold dope, shot people, all this shit in the same city. So if I leave and you don't want to come, I'm gonna leave. I'm changing my life. I done dodged prison, I've been in prison twice. I ain't trying to be there the rest of my life. So of course I'm gonna leave. I'm not leaving my kids, I'm leaving you. I still be there for my kids rather this day. Okay, for then the child's supposed to put me in jail. I'm glad that she out reaching out to everybody, letting everybody know because my lawyer, like, you feel me? He own that. So I ain't even tripping on none of that. I'm good on all that. My life's good. I'm in a big ass house. My fiance right here. You feel me? I got a pool in the backyard, you know? I got, you feel me? Well, that's Melissa, but, but you're making her point because what she's saying is you have the money. Why are you not take? Why are you not helping her out with your four kids? Like you have a new woman, so you do. Do you think? Do you think you left her once you got so famous? Show me the cash. They got more money. What, what is it? Let's, yeah, I'm just finna. I'm just finna show. I'm just finna. I'm just finna show the world my 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 crew. I got a stack of paper. See, I'm on. I'm on my shit right now. I'm finna show y'all. I'm finna show y'all something. See this. See it's two sides to every story. I got everything right here. What one thing she's trying to do? You're not trying to work. I mean, you've been with the government all your life. You see, that's all you. 
That's all you know. You go to the government and continue to let them help you. Hey, babe, where the papers at? I'm on her. Like, that's one thing I learned. You feel me? Like, I learned, I learned to stop running from the white folks. You feel me? Like, I'm running to them. Like, you can't, you can't try to bash my career and do all this. I wasn't none of this when I was in the streets. I wasn't no deadbeat when I was in prison. I wasn't no deadbeat when I was getting shot at. Running from the law, you was dealt. But when I changed my life, you want to bash this and that, this and that. Blah, 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 blah. Cool. But I got everything right now. I'm waiting on it. But I'm glad. I got, I got a question. I got a question. So I got a question. If what you're saying is true, how was she able to lock you up last November for she not started, paying child support? She started, I've never been on child support for one. Never. I want she just put me in child support back in 20, 2019 when I popped. And get that clear. Never been on child support. I just came, just got on child support when I popped. Money home, like I said. Boy, he go, he go everything right here. I'm waiting. This is what I'm waiting on. Sir? Yeah, these, this is, this is yeah, these are all my cash as payment. That's new cash. How much do you pay your money? Yeah, that, that ain't all about all that, but this is what I'm sending her. It ain't about that. I'm just, I'm just on her ass. Like, I'm on. But that says $20, $10. No, these, these are different. Yeah, they're okay. just different. Yeah, of course, it's going to be a little pay, a little money, but all this shit adds up. All this shit adds up. So, 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 you're saying the allegations she made about you being a Debbie dad. I tell you what, I got true. four kids by her. My oldest son. When's the last time you saw your kids? When's yeah, the last time you saw your kids? The same time kid? that she tried to put me in jail when I had them, when she dropped them off to me. She played little, she played little, she, she played little that duck ass November. games. She, she played little police ass games like that. You feel me? But, but you haven't no, I see. I just, I was just in the city. I just, I just dropped my kids off Valentine stuff at they, at they uh school. See, she, she's so nasty. She's so dirty. She take, she take my name off the list. So I got to do everything I do now. I got to bring the police there. I got to let my judge know. I got to let my my lawyers know all this. So now. It's like I can't just deal with my kids like court order because she take their phone, she make them not talk to me, she take them off the um, parenting list at schools and all this shit. So it's like I got to go through all the over all the obstacles and all this other shit to deal with my kids because I'm not dealing with you. That's the whole thing, and my bitch better than her. You feel me? But it, it's like it's like like I say, it's like it's like a hate thing. Now it's like you came from supporting me. To my business, my biggest enemy right now. For why I don't know. You feel me? It just. Well, she. I, I mean, she. I mean, according to her, she's raising these kids just, by herself. She, you no, are. The you have the this money. You have a new. No, woman, the government raising my child. kids. Like that girl, bro. I'm telling you, that girl, bro. Like I respect every black woman with kids, or whatever. I'm. A, I'm one of the fathers that that made baby that want to be there. You feel me? Like. I never left my kids. She would tell you that. My 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 oldest son is thirteen. He's old enough to talk. You feel me? And that's where I'm at right now. Like when, when we go to court and all this, she's gonna come out. But at the end of the day, it's like it's not about me. It's not about her. It's about my kids. At the end of the day, you want to bash me because I don't want to. Chew. I don't. I, it's not that I'm not trying to be with my kids. It's not that I'm not trying to parent with you. It's not that I'm trying to come to no type of agreement. To deal with you and my kids, but deal with my kids as co-parents. You deny every asset that I'm trying to go to deal with my kids because I'm not dealing with you. And that's what it is. Like a whole a whole year and a half straight, she ran me and my other bitch. Taking pictures of the tags, pulling up at their houses, pulling all up at a job, like sending the police, sending the other little wretched ass bitches to a job, like interviewing and all like little pet ass, little stupid shit like that. This is what she do. You feel me? But I'm not gonna, I'm bigger, and like I said, like I'm wiser now. Like, there's a lot of shit I'm gonna do that I used to do. Like, I really like slow down. I really like saving myself for a reason. But it just, I don't have time to go back and forth with one female when I have access to the whole world. And it's more, it's more women, more females out here that want to do stuff. Want to be somebody? 
want to go back to school, trying to learn, trying to, trying to like grow with somebody. Like you don't want to do none of that. You want a nigga that to, to take care of you. You want to ship dope and shit in and out of prison. You want to bring dope and shit. You feel me? This is what you want to do. I'm not in that position no more. So if that's what you still want to do, go ahead and get you a nigga in the state and you can keep on trafficking and whatever you want to do. That's what you want to do. And don't bring me and bash my name and bash my faith, my image and all this because you're thinking I don't want to be with my kids, but I don't want to be with you. Come on, that's but by me being a by me being a black male, I'm going every 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 man gonna go through this. So it's like at the end of the day, it doesn't even matter. Like I said, it ain't about me at the end of the day. So like I'm good. Like she got five, she got five kids. Well, I'm she, very she happy got you five came kids. on. She looking for love. I'm very happy you came on. She got five story. kids. Yes, she has five kids and she has four, she has five, four kids by you. Love. I'm good. That's one thing about it. Like, I'm not feeling... Yeah, because it's easier. No. Let me say this. It's easier for a man to have four kids and find a new woman. It's not always that easy for women but you to have five kids and find a new woman. One thing about a female, a female will always, like, y'all struggles is not struggles. Because at the end of the day, you have... You have She's raising... Her, your your kids are in her house. You think she's not struggling every day? She has five kids in her home. She has a struggle. No, she's not. She's not struggling. She's she's struggling because she trying to she trying to pay attention and be in everybody else's business. She's not focusing on herself and what she got to do to better herself. That's why she want to be struggling. You too busy trying to case me up and put cases on me and badge me and kill my fame, kill my image, and at the end of the day. You not taking care of reality, real life. That's this real world, like you know, like this shit right here. Ain't, this shit bring me more problems. Than I don't want to be here right now. Like I ain't asked for none of this. It's a blessing with God. Like if I asked for it, I would have been here a long time ago when I caught my first shooting case. I wouldn't be here. Like I ain't asked for this, but I'm not finna look over my blessings. I'm not finna keep on being disobedient and 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 just overlooking shit in life. I'm not finna do it. Like you not for me, you not for me. Like you can think you say the same, whatever. Like that's what it is. Okay, well, listen, y'all have four kids together, so I hope y'all can find a way to co-parent well. But I'm happy you came on. If y'all don't know his child's mother, call me last night on Facebook. It's gonna be a highlight tonight, so you guys will be able to see. You're seeing his version before you see her version, and you will. And you will be. A, I'll make sure I'll give your version to the people too. All right, Wayne. Like, I appreciate not, you coming on. Is that what I'm calling you? The name is Mr. Wayne. Call me Wayne. Deep Wayne. Yeah. Charles. Yeah. Well, I will say this: she got. If you don't pay your child support payment, she said she got another date March first. Like I said, don't have a wide neck and a wide butt. Make sure you take take care of your child support payment. 